It's a historic breeding farm for a 138-year-old program started by Joseph Patel of the prominent Middlebury family. And uh, Joseph wanted to restore the Morgan to its prominence in an era where mechanization and the automobile were making inroads and horses were becoming second thought. Well, I think it's an outstanding look at a working operation. Uh, the farmscape is just gorgeous. The horses are some of the best Morgans in the world. Well, this historic herd of Morgans and the beautiful farmscape are key attractions to the county, one of the leading attractions tourism-wise. The horse industry in general is uh, a booming part of agribusiness here. And, uh, to the tune of uh, $17 million annual expenditures for equine enterprises in this state. And the university has been given the stewardship of this property now, and they're the longest owner for 50 some years, and uh, very proud to assume that responsibility. We have about five to 10 labs each year. Typically, an uh, uh, undergraduate might do a special problems research um, opportunity with us. They might do a uh, workshop in reproduction is an area that, of expertise for our staff. They might do an internship. That might be typical of a university student, a Vermont student, for a specialized um, apprenticeship. Well, I think the Chamber of Commerce and um, the tourism industry in general recognizes the value and beauty of this place. So it's uh, a standard recommendation and uh, we do get a lot of Middlebury parents and incoming students. This is a major jogging route for Middlebury College and, and the town. So people just appreciate seeing the vistas from Morgan Horse Farm Road.